<laughs> oh my god, I'm such a child. What's up, buddies? Welcome back to another epi of the ultimate road to glory. It is day one of the EA Access trial. We have full access, of course, to the game. Um, there, there's so much to, to touch bases with. If you guys want a full update on this series, how we're running things, what we're doing... Um, please check episode one. I kind of go in great detail about what the plan is. I know it's a long episode, but the first 10 or 15 minutes, we kind of cover what the plan is uh, for this specific series. It's basically um, a, a combination of everything I love. The insane grind of the poor man road to glory, bronze packs, league SBCs, uh, a bit of funding from the rich man road to glory from two years ago. I still have FIFA points on this account from uh buying them from in the, at the tail end of fifa 18 that we still have not used so technically they're kind of free to me for this year but either way that's what we're dealing with uh in terms of the the funding on the account that's not going to change the grind on the series uh it may change obviously the first couple of weeks where i just don't have anything in the club and the way the poor man road to glory starts off however the first the last 24 hours we've treated this account like a straight up poor man rtg account and we've made uh, not just the coins that you can see there but we've got in the transfer list as well another 30 or forty thousand coins just uh buying and investing and flipping players that you need for advanced SBCs is kind of what we're doing right now in terms of advice on how to grind your poor man road to glory that will be happening through this episode as well so just bear with me there in terms of the early access so as of right now i don't know if there is a glitch for unlimited hours for the 10 hour trial however so far it seems like there is a glitch where you can get another 10 hours on another account and apply it to your main account whether you're running a poor man rich man ultimate rtg whatever you're running so i will walk you guys through that when the time comes i've obviously got 10 hours still on the account or i'll link in the description for you guys an explanation it's very easy a couple of years ago you're able to do it on playstation you basically just log in on the 10 hours and then you switch accounts once you actually get into uh fun it should be very easy i'll walk you guys through it if and when we need to do that um in terms of though if you don't want to be doing that or you only have the the the, the 10 hour trial my biggest recommendation day day one what you should be doing on your account is exactly not what i'm doing right now so what you should be doing is kick ball on console that's it squad battle grind your division rivals placements get your division rival placements in as quickly as possible uh once you get your qualifications done right here in division rivals you get an initial coin boost so that is something that's new to the game this year i don't know if it's a glitch i don't know if it's a one-time thing i haven't i don't have any confirmation of that yet obviously because i'm just on the game right now but i believe if you if you qualify in division five or higher you you get like 50 60 or 70 000 coins or, or something like that to just just to start with so that's an amazing boost for everybody which obviously if the whole community gets that the pricing of players is going to be shifting up pretty quickly here nevertheless you want to be just in gameplay on the 10 hour trial if you're only going to do the 10 hours for me i'm not too concerned with it because i'm planning on just getting another 10 hours um once this one expires so on and so forth and then by october 6th which is really at this point uh, a few days away four or five days away from now then we all get full access to the game anyways um a couple of things here now obviously i i could care less about whether or not how or how you choose to play the game if you look at the top left of the screen you'll notice a few things I am not here to make you feel bad for spending FIFA points on the game. I'm not here to make you feel bad for not spending FIFA points on the game. I'm not here to make you feel bad for spending a lot of time on the game or spending a little bit of time on the game. We're all here uh, for our various loves and enjoyments of football and Ultimate Team as a combination. Uh, I feel though for me, and I've done it for the last six or seven years um, in terms of my FIFA Ultimate Team experience and on YouTube, that this game does promote gambling. That's just the 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 way the cookie crumbles and the way EA have set it up. They might not want people to talk about it, but that is just the way uh, it is. So I truly do... Shut up, Siri, you batch! Um, I truly do believe that this game should not be a Peggy 3 game, which means EA says and, and tells parents that this game is safe for three-year-olds and up when you can go into the store, which I have absolutely no fucking idea where the store is. Where even is the store? Where you can go into the store here um, and gamble away your uh, money to get, hopefully, some good packs. 
I don't have a problem with that, just like I don't have a problem with drinking alcohol, just so like I don't have a problem if you want to take gummies, or I don't have a problem with, with, um, uh, with, with driving a car, but these things should be age-gated to, 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 to the correct ages. So just like drinking alcohol is 18, or if you live in a really messed up place like the US, it's 21, I think just like other gambling sites, there should be an age gate at least on the store. So I'm going to say this only once, but that's my thoughts on it. So why I have FIFA points blocked is because one of the last things I want to do is have everything set up. Now, my streams are set up for uh, mature audiences, 18 plus audiences. Uh, I talk about FIFA points and, and, and what the pitfalls of being addicted to playing this game 10 hours a day or spending money on this game. Either way, I do it as much as I can. But I feel like through the years, I've been a bit of a hypocrite because th the points are just there right so whenever you have an impressionable little kid come into this stream um or even check out the youtube video and just see an insane amount of fifa points on the account i feel like automatically it kind of gives them that thought process of oh okay so whatever i'm gonna go throw on 4600 fifa points and light my money on fire for that or whatever the case may be it's weird i have the discount in fifa points but other people don't um so I'm not hiding the FIFA points to hide them from you guys. For those of you that know my channel, know what FIFA points we're sitting on anyways. It's more so for two reasons. First of all, I feel like it's a flex. I don't want to flex on you guys in terms of how much money I'm burning on the game and you aren't burning any money on the game. Um, I just don't want to do that. Second of all, and the most important thing is... I want that section, I want people to go up and look at the top left of the screen and be automatically drawn to the most important thing that we do on this channel every single year, which is raise money for cancer research um, and raise money for charity. So the first thing you're going to see on stream is money raised year to date for um, cancer research. And we're up to $705 raised already, which is incredible. Thank you guys so much. The 40 hour should be 40 hour charity stream, might be longer, might be shorter, I'm not entirely sure yet. But the charity stream, our sixth annual charity stream for cancer research is starting October 9th for the global launch of the game. Um, and that is what I wanna draw your eyes to first. Second of all, just having the FIFA points there and having the 18 plus only, it's a conversation starter. For someone that doesn't know my standing uh, about FIFA points, about, about believing that packs truly are gambling, someone will come into the channel and be like, why is this FIFA points covered? Why is there 18 plus there? And I'm hoping you guys that know where I stand because I'm not going to repeat myself beyond this episode too, too often about my thoughts about gambling on packs and you having to be a certain age to do that type of stuff. Um, I'm not going to go on about it forever. So I want that top left to be just a conversation starter for you guys uh, about the exact topic. And then you guys, if you see someone asking, why is this FIFA points covered? Do you see someone in the in the comment section of the YouTube video? Like, why is he even covering that? That's so ridiculous. Like, why is he trying to hide that stuff from us? I'm hoping one of you guys can be like, well, actually, no, Nick just doesn't want to be flexing his points on people. He believes that there should be an age gate on spending your actual money gambling on this game, so on and so forth. And we can keep that conversation going. So... I hope that it works out. I think it looks beautiful. I think it looks very clean. And of course, because I'm grinding, because we're trying to build up coins to buy players, because I'm investing in players, I'm going to do all of the poor man road to glory grind, as well as past and present squad builders, so on and so forth. I thought it was important just so that you guys could still see the coins, to see where the coin balance is at, how much money we're making, and um, you know what the club is looking like. Second of all, the record. For those of you guys that are like, oh, okay, cool, but why can't we see the record? You want to know why? Because who gives a shit? That's why. I don't understand how still to this point EA have this record showing. This record, the, the top left record is the dumbest thing ever, in my opinion. The only record that matters is your FUT Champs record. That's the, if you want to talk being good at FIFA or being competitive at FIFA, you, the only record that matters is your FUT Champs record and then maybe your actual division rivals placement. Like if you're in D1, well, there's no surprise you're a fantastic FIFA player. Same thing. If you're hitting elite every week or you're, you're, you're casually getting gold one every week, you're a fantastic FIFA player. Those are the only records that matter. The top left record, I feel like far too many people, you guys included, um, are so concerned with having a good record and far too many people insult people that don't have a great record. Some of the best FIFA players out there have damn near an even record because all they do is play games in D1 and play FUT Champs competitively. But then you have these Silver 1 plebs that go spam like 60 games of squad battles, have a good record a couple months in and think they're actually good at FIFA. So to me... I think that's yet the next thing. It's like, we're just moving away from the record. If you want to know what my overall record is, put exclamation mark record in my Twitch chat. You'll see my FUT Champs record for the week. That should be the only record that matters. So now that we have that all out of the way, I think we can finally move on to what really matters, which is getting into the grind for the account. So 
on the web app i wanted to make sure i had a couple of things done i have no idea how to use this game so i don't know what i'm looking at where's the squad dude i want to show you guys my squad but i don't really um i i i, I how, how where the hell is the stadium up on the analog wait up oh you have to load it okay okay so what i did on um on the web app is i kind of got things starting uh with the as much lead stuff as i can so we got the leads home kit of course first time back in the premier league after 16 years sixth place in the league after three games super happy um nevertheless we got that all set up uh, we got the ball that we use pretty much every single year. We got the Leeds badge. And then I'll work on this other stuff as time progresses. Uh, in terms of the crowds, I don't know. I've got a Leeds crowd chant. I've got the home end TIFO. I've got the stadium theme as well for Leeds. So you'll see when we do start opening packs, um, the, the there's like Leeds stuff everywhere, which obviously I, I love and super excited about. I don't know if there's a main stand lower TIFO and a club anthem. If there is for Leeds... Please let me know whether it's in the Twitch chat or in the comment section of this epi. Uh, absolutely, please um, let me know, okay? Because I'm I'm very interested in in getting that all set up. Uh, in terms of the sidelines, I believe this is all like trophies and whatnot. So we'll we'll get this stuff sorted out as time progresses. Structure, same thing. I believe this is right now. I just got like a leads look uh, stand. Now the one thing is. Do, can I, do I get a, do I have to go get a bigger stadium to get more customization out of it? Is that what we got to do? I know this to a lot of people doesn't matter. I, I kind of like it. I, I like being able to customize my stadium out. Um, I love having all the lead stuff everywhere too. I think it looks absolutely fantastic. So um, for me, I'm pretty amped up about it. But anyways, I wanted to show you guys that. So then if, do I go, okay, so you load it down to the squad. There you go. So here, here is the team we're working with. So yesterday... Uh, we ended up buying Calvin Phillips, 650. We packed Robin Koch. Uh, nice big German cock right there. And uh, we got the god, the king himself. We got Marcelito, who has his own card in game as well. So the Leeds build is there or thereabouts. The rest of the team is all untradeable as of right now. So that's what we're looking like. Okay. I just I wanted to I wanted to kind of update you guys on this stuff um ea play member you've received 3500 xp boost to kickstart your season oh okay sure now we've done a lot of grinding on the web app so i wanted to go look at these objectives here as well and see what exactly that means unfortunately on the web app the foundation stuff doesn't exist which is unfortunate um filled with things to learn and master the basics will get you started on that path okay thank you sir so chemistry change formation got ourselves an artist chem style don't mind if i do that's all done and what i would recommend for those of you guys running uh any type of road to glory whether it's a rich man whether it's a poor man you really want to start grinding through foundations as quickly as possible and uh to what i showed you guys yesterday uh in episode one on the web app is you absolutely want to get through the grind of the starter SBCs. Now, unfortunately for me, I'm still waiting on a DM uh, to finish off one of the starter SBCs. Uh, I think tomorrow we're going to do the advanced SBCs. So I'm going to show you guys uh, how to go through and do the advanced SBCs. That'll probably be for, for tomorrow's epi. And then, uh, yeah, today's going to be all about the grind. Now, did we get marquee matchups as well? It is now 6 p.m. UK. So I, I don't know if this early we're going to get new content from EA, especially considering it's early access. But if we did get um sbcs that is another way to make coins so one of the things to do early on on your poor man road to glory is get early investments for marquee matchups you will be shocked at how profitable they are there's so many different areas in the community i'm not going to be one that's going to be predicting um what the matchups are going to be or what i think the matchups are going to be there's a lot of places a lot of guys on twitter fut spy posts a lot of stuff on twitter about what he thinks are going to be the marquee matchups so if you want to go follow those types of guys on twitter i would highly recommend and then just get discard investments right that's a really really good way to get passive income uh on your road to glory also what i've noticed is because so many people are doing the starting sbcs the bronze pack method is actually not bad I still think I would wait to dump a lot of time and money into the bronze pack method, maybe until league SBCs are out. However, the BPM is still very, very good, even early days, because you need three center mids, 
uh, that are bronze. You need three center backs. You need, uh, I believe, two strikers, was it? And a cam. Uh, you need DMs, left backs, center backs, uh, all of that type of stuff. So you tend uh strikers right mids right wingers into right forward so there's a lot of profit there if you know what to look for as your opening bronze pack so in terms of foundations we've got go to the squad challenge tile and complete the league and nations basic group so we will do that one probably not right now though single player so play team of the week play feature squad win a squad battle play five squad battles now see the coin boost so you you want to make sure you're getting those things done and another thing i would be doing during early access so again if you only have 10 hours my best recommendations are if you're gonna if you want a nice balance of coins to grind with my, my two recommendations are get your five division rivals qualifications in you get that 50k or 40k or 70k that's huge for your web app trading until october 6th or 9th when the full game is out number two is get your squad battle games in as much as you can not only is it going to give you boosts here right which gives you more coins a few packs to work with etc but also and more importantly is i believe in a couple of days you get your squad battle rewards now all of us that weren't lucky enough to get the game early right like like some content creators or people that knew some people that worked at a store that got the game for free i think nep got it that way not for free sorry probably paid a lot of money for it but got the game early uh, we all missed out on division rival rewards, which I believe were out today. But the next set of rewards that are coming in three days or four days or whatever are squad battle rewards. So it's early days, but that is my recommendation for your 10 hours is kickball, play squad battles uh, until the Sunday, and then get your five qualification games in. And outside of that, only spend time on EA play if you're playing. For me, obviously, totally different, but nevertheless, a um, bit of advice there. Now, in terms of objectives and stuff like that i am new to all of this so th this episode is going to be a bit clunky i do apologize guys because i don't know anything we did we looked at the milestones um yesterday i kind of want to do these daily objectives to play two matches fut friendlies uh win a match win one match so i wouldn't mind doing that early access probably want to do that too Play three matches in live foot friendlies. Three nations. Okay. Um, win four co-op matches in any foot game mode. Ooh. All right. Might have to get Armalika in on these. Um, find finishing score finesse goal in two separate rivals matches. Okay. World class pass. Assist using midfield for... Okay. And then play four matches in rivals using a starting squad, getting at least three players bought from the transfer market. Okay, so that's not necessarily a big deal. Um, in terms of three nations for objective, you got to win four in fought friendly. So that's similar to the early access, right? So you can do two and one there. Score 10 goals in live fought friendlies, three nations. K. Okay. Assist eight goals in live fought friendlies, three nations. So again, another bit of trading advice here is stuff like this, right? So. Focus on some of the top nations, Argentina. Not only are they going to be good to trade with for the advanced SBCs, but could be good to just make bits of profit here and there from England players, Dutch players, Spanish players, Portuguese players for these types of specific um, SBC requirements. French players. Oh, League 1 players. Okay, maybe get a bit of a trade going on with League 1 players. Maybe Jonathan David players like that. Win three matches with Mbappe, at least five League 1 players in the starting 11. There you go um score a hat trick using a french player so french league Iron player is probably going to be a bit boosted in price right now um score the finesse shot using mbappe so i'm assuming i'll get a loan mbappe through the season's progress right play online squad battles transfer market this will get done in no time as well um just with the trading that we're going to be doing on the account um wait didn't we get like 3000 xp or something like that where did the XP go? And then community. So community is new. Um, community event. Work together as a FUT community towards the same goal. Join the global FUT community uh, in this cooperative community event. Complete objectives as a community. Progress together. So apparently, I think it was Nep that was saying this is kind of dead right now. Uh, 14 days. Work together with the community to collectively reach a milestone to earn reward. So apparently it's all like just... Yeah, that's dead. Um, worked so so. How how? 
I, don't, I, I hope this stuff changes. Obviously, I don't want it all to be vanity items. I don't care about any of this. Um, so, com do I need to do any of this or will the community just do it on its own? <laughs> Can I be lazy? Do, you ha do I have to give, give a minimum effort here? How, what do you do? Where, where's the like description of what you need to do? Complete one to be eligible. Oh, complete one. Yeah, you do have to contribute. Wait, where, where, so what do I, what? What do I do? Where is it? Press triangle? Oh, view objectives. Jesus, Lord have mercy. Human versus machine. Ah, here we go. Win two squad battle matches in co-op. All right, Armalika, we're going to be doing this, bro. Win five matches having only gold players in your starting squad. Okay, does that count as rares or only non-rares? Interesting. Uh, I guess so. One to watches and stuff like that. Informs, none of that will really help. Or you won't be able to use that. Play a rivals match in co-op. Kind of like that. I do like that they're almost like ad advertising it. That's a pretty sweet thing. Um, score in 10 separate squad battle matches. Okay. Uh, so we, I, we, we got to play squad battles, boys. Again, even for me, I don't think I'm going to be putting much effort into division rivals outside of the initial five qualification games. The rest of it, I'm going to wait till like probably October 9th. Because I notice a lot of people saying already that gameplay is better. Dudes, I, among all other FIFA players and pros, etc. The first week of FIFA 20, we were all saying there was good bones to the game. Couple of little tweaks here and there, and the game could be semi-decent. And then a month later, the entire game was a disaster. Because the entire community was on the game, on top of EA's patches that broke the game further. So... I'm going to wait until October 9th, I think, to go heavily into um, Division Rivals gameplay. I don't know if I'm too concerned with it. Um, or October 6th, at the very least. Maybe a couple of days before rewards are out. So that way we can we can get some, uh, some rewards for Thursday. But I'm not going to go too heavily. I think I want to focus on squad battles and learning the game. We're going to play on Legendary or Ultimate. Uh, apparently, Legendary and Ultimate are pretty rough this year. So we'll be testing that out. Play 15 matches, having only first-owned players in your starting squad. Okay, so EA force us, forcing us down a first owner route, which is pretty interesting. Um, okay, so if anything, I'll probably try and focus on first owner, um, a first owner team for the time being uh, from the Prem, which is all good. Co-op and Conquer, I like that too. How did I miss these? Welcome to Friendlies, all of that stuff. Okay, so... Did I miss anything to overview for you guys? Milestones we looked at in episode one. So I don't know if we really, I don't know if you met, you care for me to go over all of this stuff again. I checked the first episode. It's whatever. I'm going to say this right now. It's, it's whatever. You know, I, I'm not, I'm not overly excited about much of it yet. It, 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 some of it's okay, but, um, club anthem pack, complete one match in a fuck game mode to unlock. Oh, okay. Okay. So here you go. Complete five matches. So all, a lot of this stuff will be getting done by accident, right? Now, in terms of transfers, um, I am going to be... Holy sh, baby. You gave me a freaking heart attack. Thank you so much. Wow, that looks good. Bacon, avocado, and toast. What do you want? Thank you, baby. I can't... I'm recording. You want me to... Steph wants me to take a bite, chat. Hold on. Jesus, Lord, have mercy. All right. There's a napkin there. There's a napkin. Okay, re ready? Oh. amazing amazing mm. so amazing thank you so much mm. Mm. thank you um so all of these guys uh previous investments trossard i'm gonna put back in the club because obviously he's first stoner um england four you know what man i think i'm gonna i think he's gonna be gone these guys are investments. I believe Diop is um is pack pulled. Let's do There you go. Not good enough to get into our starting squad though, right dudes? Uh Gilbert do that. Do you guys hear that? I hope this doesn't break the recording, man, but the um the audio is a bit behind right now. So, I think what I'm going to do is um re like reactivate it i'm so sorry if this glitches out for you guys for a second here i apologize um
Okay. There we go. Should be should be better now. Um, Rojo, I think, dude, I, Rojo especially being seven fifty, I think he'll have a decent price, you know, down the road. Um, all of these, this guy just does not seem to be selling. I thought this guy would have a nice little, uh, nice little price tag. Might not be in people's um, uh, in people's squad builders just yet. Okay. Um, and then all of this stuff. I actually think I'm going to keep the Sud players for now. Um, two for now. The Sud Lib grind. How excited is Nepenthe is going to be once the Sud Lib uh, grind comes back? So L2 to put them in the club. Is any of this stuff different nowadays, guys? Or no? Uh, and then I think I'm going to relist this that this is all like advanced sbc stuff dudes um just player that are necessary for advanced sbc so are necessary or will become necessary for advanced sbcs for that way yeah are you giving me now whipped cream for my coffee no 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 that no, no i don't want that i don't want that i don't no 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 but this i do this is amazing look at that i don't know if anybody can even see it what is my life dude FIFA 21 day one. No, no, oh God, no, no, God, no, no. That's cringe. It's cringe. It's cringe. I don't want. I don't want that in my mouth. I don't want it in my mouth. Thank you very much. You're amazing. Uh, stop it! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Thank you. Mm, whipped cream everywhere. I love it. I want your life, man. It's only one FIFA one FIFA bronze pack away, bro. Just get good at opening bronze packs, and you can do all the things I do. <laughs> um. Okay, so this is good. I want to go check the SBCs too, boys. Before we start dipping into uh, to, to, to packs and whatnot and all that stuff, I want to go check out the SBCs and see what we're looking for. Um, Marky matchups is something I do want to do today. Uh, and, 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 and then obviously be able to show you guys who is going to have a semi-decent value as well. Oh. Prices down a little bit. The price increase hasn't been as much as we want. Also, if you pack these players or have these players in your club, don't be discarding them, man. Stay focused. Stay focused on player prices. Don't get lazy. I don't care if you're starting with zero FIFA points. What whatever amount of FIFA points you're you're. Uh, this guy just isn't gonna sell, by the way. Um, ultimately I'm going to put in the club for now. I feel like he'll actually, his price will just be, keep going up. So I'm not overly concerned. If we get him as a dupe, we'll try and sell. Um, Saldi ever should sell too. Um, not as much profit as, as I was hoping for ever, but it, it'll get there. So, and this leaves us a lot of room. So the plan for this grind as well, boys, is going to be um where we grind until the trade pile is full and then we go into gameplay so i think it's going to be squad battles to start i suppose right there's so many different like avenues and yes this is going to be the main focus for the ultimate rtg there's going to be a few staple players that i want back rio Cruyff, and hullet are going to be uh one of them um cantona hasn't even been packed yet so so we kind of got to be a bit patient on that one. Um, okay, now where are SBCs, guys? What the hell are SBCs? Squad building challenges. How do I go to it, though? Is it objectives? Where? Play? It, it's in play? Oh, weird. SBCs, yeah, there you go. What? Why? Okay, that's interesting. Um, again, doing all this. Here are the marquee matchups, boys. Let's see. So, premium goal player pack, 25k player pack to start. Um, Spurs Man United was obviously an easy call, I would say for sure. Um, Bruges Anderlecht, another good one. Um, 
so Belgian players three, players from the same league five, rare players two, silver players five. So investment in silvers is always a good a good move on that. That's nice. League uh, Uber Eats. Um, just two players. Okay, so these are pretty chill. There's no uh, excessive requirements here. Leipzig or Schalke players. So, going through your club right now and seeing, you do need gold players too. Um, but gold and silver, overall rating of 74. So, you could even slip some bronzes in if you wanted to. But go check Leipzig or Schalke players. You need one of them at least, with two being Bundesliga. And then Man United or Spurs players with a 75 rating overall. So, that's not necessarily bad. I, I don't think player prices are going to be that crazy. For Leipzig, Schalke, or United or Spurs, so it shouldn't be too bad. But still, I'd go check your uh, check your clubs right now, and if you do have these players, piecing these together would be a good call. Small prime silver player pack isn't that great. Small prime electrum pack can be good. Premium mixed player pack can be good, and then a prime electrum pack. That's not bad, boys. I I would definitely be putting uh, some effort into getting that done. And considering it's not as crazy as the advanced SBCs for for chemistry, should be very easy to do. Very, very easy to do. So um, we'll be doing that one. Hybrid leagues, uh, hybrid nations, uh, league of nations. Let's keep going. This one, I still need a DM pack pulled from England three or four league of nation SBC. So those are the focal points for me tomorrow. Uh, I think we're going to be trying to do some of the advanced SBCs. I'm not entirely sure which one's first. Marquee matchups, those is, uh, is something we'll do near the end of the epi today. So is it time, boys? Do we dip our toe into the casino? I think we do. I think we do. Now, I'm very interested to see. I was watching a few um, a few videos about how to tell if it's a walkout. So apparently, the, the lines on... How good is that with the lead stuff, boys? I didn't even... I couldn't even tell. I don't think that's anything special, particularly. Okay, so it's a rare. Um, so apparently... The, the boards on the left, if one of them is missing, it is a, uh, it's a walkout. That's the only thing I know. That's the only thing I'm familiar with at, at all right now. Um, anyways, Al Ramos, Vidan, Kevin, JSY, Polo, Ryan. I appreciate you dudes very, very much, man. Thank you all for the resubs. Uh, da boy, everybody, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So another thing what I'm going to do, no matter how little or much you 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 spend on packs any packs you open for me i am going to be someone that discards everything i'm not a content creator that's going to store three trillion um consumables that i'm never going to use i'm not going to be storing players that i'm never going to use uh so i will be discarding everything the only thing i'm going to be doing is i'm going to be storing uh position changes and chem styles uh that have a value now i'm tempted to just sell these outright and so then the idea is we open packs until we have a hundred items in the trade pile full, and then we go play gameplay. That is what I think would be the best move because it will keep me playing games, right? So we're not going to sit here for hours at a time spamming packs. So Ruven Vezo, someone like this, does he have a value? Yes. So this is going to be for advanced SBCs, I would assume. Um, so we'll pop them up for that much. Ruben Vezo. For those of you guys uh, that are grinding, I can't imagine any of these dudes are going to have much of a value beyond discard. How annoying is it though? Once again, I repeat that I cannot list these guys for, for less than 700, yet they only discard for 300. I find that disgusting from EA um, and absolutely idiotic. So all of these guys are discard and boom, there you go. Uh, yes, and do not show this message again. Um, no fitness is fantastic. Sure, I, I, I would agree. For those of you guys that, um, that 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 care, no fitness is good. It won't hurt bronze pack method, so I don't think that's a walkout at least. Hmm, boy. Okay. Um. Also, what do you guys think will be our first 10k player that we pack? What are we saying, bro? This is massive, and this is why. If you're grinding the game, Bully for the rest of the year will be discard. So the fact that we're going to get a little bit of money out of him is fantastic. Um, this dude is not really worth all that much. Um, so what are we thinking is going to be the first big uh, pickup for us? Sentiment to cam cards. I like that these are all non-rares now. I think that's a good thing. Um, all that. I 
was too busy stuffing my <coughs> my fat face. First walkout, boys. Four packs in. Let's go. Things you absolutely love to see. Oh. Um. Okay. I forgot to look at the boards, dude. Oh god. He looks good in the leads kit, boys, huh? Hell yeah. Okay. Um, so my rule for players to sell is if they are worth more than 10k, I'm gonna hold. Yeah, I'm holding. So we will be able to use him. Um Beltman. Go catalyst. So I just feel like it's too early to be cashing out someone like that. Uh, so I'm just going to hold. Yeah. The gambling is paying off, boys. I love casinos, dude. They're delaying the menu was the same yesterday. Was it? Okay. Yeah, they're like sticky. The menus are sticky. So like it gets caught on a player as you're moving through them and shit. How could they... The menus were delayed last year. How are they worse this year in early access? I think that's a board. Hell yeah! Ooh! Tags! Let's go, boys! So again, someone like Tagliafico. Would you be keeping him if you hit him? I don't know personally whether or not I should be keeping someone like this, guys. I do not know. What are we saying? Um, Hestio, Wally, CKY, thank you. Um, is he is he cheap? Yeah, he's too cheap right now. Okay, so we'll hold him. Mr. Yanmat, Dutch. I think I'm gonna keep him too, just just for uh squad building. Argentinian in La Liga. Him uh for squad building, send him into cam cards. These were expensive last year too. What about Hakimi? Seems cheap. Uh, oh yeah, stadium themes and stuff like that. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be keeping. Makes a change for you to be skipping packs. No, what? I skip packs all the time. I wasn't paying attention. I didn't see whether it was walking or not. Will I sell if I hit an icon? Oh, Chillwell. Could use him actually. Uh, what's his cost right now? Oh, hell yeah. Okay, he'll go into the team. This guy had a great game against Leeds as well, man. What a beast. I don't know how the hell Sheffield managed to pick this guy up. Absolute monster. In fact, I might keep him too. Gigot should be worth a little something. There you go, because of SBCs. In fact, I think I'm going to keep him. Uh, Conti. Look at this, dude. What are What is this? Oh, my God. Is it in objectives? Okay. Got four objectives done. Oh, seasons. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right, guys. You're right. There it is. So, if you log in and log out, you get your EA Play XP boost. There's the first one. There is the second one. I guess we're going with Bear, right? For Canada. Where's the moose, EA? What the heck, man? These are so dead, by the way. I know it's like the start of the game, but it's just I can't believe that they're 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 regurgitating the same type of. What? What just happened? What? The hell oh because we checked conti and that's what glitched out right what the hell? what just happened that like hurt my brain i don't even know what i'm even looking at what what <laughs> all right oh erickson nice okay we got erickson for nine games maybe we'll use him in our uh squad battles and placement games hell yeah Okay. I, and another thing I'm going to make sure to do is use my loans this year. 
previous years i like would discard loans or, or not ever use them or anything like that um so i have a pack oh yeah 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 this one premium gold pack all right let's see come on baby objectives pack not a walkout not a board What I really like about this year. Damn though, no oh untradeable, but hey, I'll take it. Um a DM a shadow. Ew uh, we'll just discard that. Um Hell yeah, man, and Vasalik. And Demar Bay. That's a great season objective pack, man. Um absolutely great. Now the question is what I'm interested in. Um this is why it's sad for people that got the game two, three days early. Do you understand the amount of money I and you guys, I'm sure as well, would have been able to make um, if we had access to the game the way other people did? Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Sick. Dude. Ridiculous. He's almost tripled in price. He's almost tripled in price, man. He was like 17... Well, not tripled, but he's more than doubled. He was not even 17k yesterday when I was looking. Have they fixed something here? Why is this so hard to do? What? Menu is 30 FPS. Dude, what is going Why is this so glitched? Wait, I added it. Oh, I don't even... I can't even buy him even if I wanted to. Oh, lol. <laughs> Yikes, dude. Maybe you should learn how many coins you have, you moron. Um. All right. It's all good. We move. We move, we move. Danilo should be useful for SBC. So I, no matter what, I don't think I'm going to sell him. Uh, so we'll keep him. Rodriguez will keep. Uh, why is a right back to right wing back card rare? And look at that though. It actually has a good value. I'm so confused by this. Um, keep the Ajax Tifo. In honor of, uh, Mr. Johan. There's, there's quite a few out there. Boards. Ruli? That's Ru- Oh, it's an inform! That's our first inform! It's not Ruli! Mr. Benitez! GG's! So the question that a lot of people will be asking, I like that there isn't music playing, so hopefully we don't get copyrighted here. Um, the question I think a lot of people will have is with something that is a discard, with any type of inform that is a discard, do you hold? Do you wait it well wait it was a walkout oh it's a second walkout all right so with something that is a disc of course it is he's an 84 i'm an idiot um do you hold on to the discard players team of the week uh ones will always rise not really dude team of the week ones people get burned hard pretty regularly when it comes to investments um so i think for now just because i have the space he's 84 rated as an inform i will hold him no matter what dude why is everything so delayed so annoying. No, it's not 10 seconds, Maddie. It's five minute timeouts, dude. You gotta you gotta adhere to the rule. If someone's putting 40,000 points into trolling a viewer to get timed out, we got it. We gotta adhere to the request. Five minute timeouts. Give me the week one discards not going up. Yeah, I, I don't feel like they will either, personally. Wendell might have a uh, a nice price. 
But because of the grind... Oh, not really. Okay, interesting. Spain too, but Argentinian will hold him. This Liga, Betis can get rid of all that. How do we know if it's a board? Uh, there will be a... I'll, I'll show you. There'll be... There's like a plinth on the bottom. At, as you go in, there'll be like a plinth on the bottom. So there's there's three lines there, so it's not a walkout. It's not... I mean, it's not anything, obviously. And then also, you'll know if it's a board based off of the doors, right? Um, I'll, I, well, I'll show you. Again. Ooh, anchor. Nice. Uh, Dennis Suarez, left wing. Might have a bit of a value. No. Uh, Phillips, no. Hennessy, no. Cam to center mid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cash out of that. Uh, Deadeye. Hey, it's 300, right? I mean, maybe I should be keeping some of these for SBC. Uh, for sorry, for, for our first squad, but Anchor is a thousand? Nah, I'm keeping that. That's silly. I've spent 6k FIFA points, no walkout yet. Welcome to the casino, brother. Where you're lighting money on fire and getting nothing. That's that is the game, the name of the game, which is why. Have a look at the top left of the screen. You're not willing to just go into the store and light your money on fire, then don't take part. Absolutely don't take part. Um, what's the celebration? Little brother. I'm going to keep the sellies too. The M to center mids have a nice value too. Um, Merrick, Hamshik, and Darun. Any any values there, guys? Why is he so expensive? What a good card, though, hey? Damn. Four star, five star. Yo, this Merrick Hamshik's kind of sick. I'm going to keep him. I don't really know why, but I'm going to. That seems like a great starting uh, starting card. 81 rated Darun feels like he should be should stay in the club as well. Timeout Nepenthes. You can't I, time out mods, you plebs. Not allowed. Not even possible. So all people have requested is to have the entire chat timed out or mods be timed out. Amazing. Uh, okay, Braithwaite, PSG Tifo might have a value as well. Uh, do you think this guy, because he's Barca? Oh. Any value in any of this? Maybe left wing to left mid. Oh. Holy. Glad I checked. Is there a glitch for the 10 hour thing? Not right now, no. Or, or, or not, not that I've seen, put it that way. Not that I've seen. The menus are very, very clunky though. Very, um, glitchy concerning considering there's about three people on the game right now so once the full game drops that feels like it's only gonna get worse packed anything so far we've packed an informed walkout and we've packed a uh regular walkout so we've packed bernardo and we've packed an inform uh uh, uh what's his name benitez or whatever so titties, I will hold. Love holding titties. And who, honestly, who doesn't? Um. Oh. Okay. Then. Discarded. Stadiums, by the way, though. Um. I would have a look. I, I tend to discard them, but I think especially early day stadiums have a decent price. If Ellen Road was in the game, you'd know it'd be expensive. Okay, so. Have I even pointed out the uh, when you know it's a board and when it isn't? Oh, that is a pull and a half. Hell yeah. Look at that. So what do you guys think? Do we hold on to this Hernandez or do we sell? Normally, players that are, like, at or above 10k, I think I'm going to hold. I feel like he's only going to go up in price. Akajima could have a good value, you know. As a starter player? Bro, this guy's discard? Liga Nos has got to be the, the, the way to go for starter squads. That's kind of insane to me that he's a uh, discard. Oh, yeah. What a great pack. Links to Davies. Yep. Yeah, he could be our uh, our CB for sure for the time being. Okay, no 
walkout. I guess Fonzie isn't a walkout either, though, right? So there's still plenty of uh, goat tier, goat tier players we can pick up. Him, I can't remember. This is definitely one of the ones that'll probably go back to being discard. Uh, sorry, discard extinct. Um. Bro, I am so sad that I missed Alfonso Davies for under 20k. I am, I, like, actually so sad about that. It's me upset. Now he's double the price. Not triple. All right, we got our first purchase, boys. I swear to God, if this is used, someone's getting punched right in their nuts. Wait, what? Third owner? Oh, I don't want that. I don't want that at all. I don't want that. That's gross. Give me that. I don't have the money again. Oh, damn it. I'm fine. This is fine, guys. Just don't worry. Okay, everybody relax. Um, okay, so. They keep taking me back to consumables, bro. Hey, man. Leads bid for Ben Rama? I hope not. I mean, Cuisance being gone is 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 tough, though. I don't know what happened in that deal. Still, still no real um, indication either as to what the heck is going on here. Sniper. Canadians, I swear to God, if this has three owners. Yes! Fonzie! Welcome! Welcome, welcome, welcome. So what are we giving Alfonso Davies, chat? What are we giving him? So that's a nice little start. Uh, we got a nice little link between him and Hernandez, too. Uh, squad... What is it? Downwards, right? Okay. So, have to readjust the team a little bit. Um... Oh, dude, it's almost like this. What is this shit? Whatever. Sorry. Sorry for. I apologize for swearing, guys. This game is weird, though. I have to say. They've clearly changed some things that I don't know why they did any of it. Um. Okay, so he's in. The, the fact that R1 now is the thing to, like, change players, I find that so idiotic. See? Right. Um. Oh. Here. It will be used as a super sub. Um, I think Bernardo will is gonna start. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I guess I don't need Chillwell anymore. How do you swap? Still how you swap? Okay. So that hasn't changed. Um, SP. Oh my god. Wasn't it L2 and R2 to switch between players on the bench? Not anymore? 
Oh god, is it all R1? Oh my lord, I'm gonna be so confused. Yeah, it's R1. Why? Why make these changes? So much better if they actually fix things that were actually wrong in the game as opposed to like just doing little th we've spent a year switching between players with r2 and r l2 and now they've made the change to r1 something as simple as that is going to take me forever to get used to um absolutely forever to get used to. but that's also because i'm an idiot okay so uh formation i'd assume we're gonna start with like a i'm just gonna in terms of formations by the way i am going to um just start with what i'm used to and then we'll um we'll go from there okay i'll make adjustments as uh as necessary um like Ericsson. hey batch nick are mods like channing eligible for recruitment to the gulag we need a good soup boy who can distribute chili to the prisoners harbor always cheats and gets double kappa Um, I'm gonna go ahead and say no for now. Get that strong link in there, and then I'm thinking of bringing in Hamshik as my box to box mid for Mezit. Uh, wide right, striker, Ham, and we'll need a LM. Well, kind of fits the uh, I mean, for the time being, it can be Perotti, whatevs. <clears throat> yeah what's his name uh he parasitch is 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 in is that inter right so i think we'll piece together uh a, a parasitch at some point let's keep it rolling boys let's keep it rolling Bro, the fact that people are rinsing their points. <laughs> Jaden getting rocked now. Oh my god. Um Okay, Orbin. Does Orbin sell? No. Burger. Hawk. Um wait, how much are Hawk again? Like seven hundred, right? Not not much. Yeah. That makes Imagine timing someone out redemption during foot champ stress. Well, well, it's not me. That's why I have mods. Mods will be doing it. I, I during foot champs, I'll probably not even be reading the chat, bro. I was like watching. Who was I watching yesterday? I was watching like a top FIFA player. Was it skills? Oh yeah, I think I was watching skills like play the draft or something like that. And bro, skills is one of the best FIFA players in this community. And anytime he would concede, it was just the worst, dude. And I'm like, I don't know how Skills doesn't want to ban his entire chat. I, d I just don't know how how someone could sit there and um, be like calm enough as a human to just be fine with it. I am a psycho. I, 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 would, be, I would ban probably 500 people a stream if my chat, you know, got on my ass that hard. Um, why do I feel like Tuka will sell? Oh, oh, whoa, the hell? 3K? Sweet, Jesus. See, like, stuff like this, man, you can even make money off. It's kind of crazy that I haven't ha packed any real, like... Oh, yes. For the past and present Dutch national team, we'll adjust the stadium theme to orange. Um... Tuca's the only Brazilian gold manager? Ah, Okay. Oh no, logic. I I I'm I'm aware. Skills just doesn't like banning people. I respect it. I I'm just saying me because I'm over I'm an oversensitive person. If some like the shit people were like abusing him for, and he's one of the best FIFA players in the community, I would I would be up in arms. 
I honest to God would be would be fucking up in arms. So I'm assuming you can't uh, customize Old Trafford, right? You just gotta sit there and roll with it. No, no customizations. Just played a rivals game with my leads kit, and the badge doesn't show. I was, dude. I I pointed that out last night. And we're going to get into one or two games here. We're kind of... I think we're like an hour and a half into the epi. I think Armalika will cut out. Oh! Let's go! Ooh, and the Leeds United Tifo. Rich Harlick out, boys! That's beautiful, man. Look at his price. People are insane. I love it. What is he, 20k? Fantastic. Okay, so that... 100%. Man in his mid-30s freaking out over pixels. What an absolute idiot. Um, It's extinct. We ballin'. We ballin'. Leeds finally getting the, the respect they deserve, dude. Um, So Richarla Goat will replace Obama Yang in the team. Uh, so that's fantastic. What the hell is this guy's name? Wait, what? Bay <laughs> Nanduo? Okay, the game froze there for a second. Froze there for a second, boys. Unfortunately. I didn't see. Was that a walkout? Ansu! No! Damn it! I wanted the Barca badge to show up so bad. Oh. Muniain. Damn it, man. His name was Fernandinho. Did he actually do a name change, though? Like, is it a fair... Uh, yeah, no. For 1,500, I'd rather hold. Um, Aguilar, hold. Center forward to striker. Can't imagine it'll be worth much. But still worth something. All right, we got, like, 20 slots left in the trade pile, boys. 20 slots. 2K, man? I think I'm still gonna sell, bro. I don't know. I think I'd rather take the 2K. It's not a walkout. We skipping. Ooh, orange and yellow, and it's a it's a rare one this time around. <laughs> nice who? Center mid to cam. Sorry. Two thousand eight hundred wins already, bro. We're balling. Um, we are balling. Is there a purple and white chat? Anyone know? Uh, in terms of what? Stadium theme? Oh, there's so many, dude. So many. Yeah, there's so much. No fitness in packs looks so weird. No worries. They've uh, they've they've put three trillion other things in packs as fodder, so. <clears throat> People think it's like a benefit to the community. It's not... It's not. It's about a hundred other awful things now uh, to fill up packs. So don't get good players. Marksman might be worthwhile keeping. Do are injuries a uh, a common occurrence, dudes? Maybe I should keep a couple of these. I mean, there are only sixty coins. I, I would actually think that'd be a semi-decent thing if injuries are a bit more common, man. I really do. How does FUT co-op work? Uh, we can test it out, but I, I'm going to need... Maybe we'll do that next, Epi. This is kind of like day one stuff. Um, the next Well, next, Epi, we're going to do advanced SPCs. We kind of got to do marquee matchups, too. Um, but maybe me bumbling through marquee matchups, I'm not going to do. Uh, what I think we'll do is we'll go play a game... Armalika can uh can can you know edit out the dead parts. Uh we'll just test a game on legendary, see how the gameplay feels, how movement feels, all of that stuff. 
then we'll uh we'll do the marquee matchups but we'll just you know i'll just show you guys us completing them and um and then we'll get those packs and we'll call it a day now uh, youtube twitch.tv slash nick 28t i am going to be streaming all day grinding this all day so uh if you guys wanted to come by after watching this epi and just continue watching me grind there's only so much content i can post to youtube obviously right so um is our like stadium themes see like i wonder is that actually valuable or is it again oh people would probably want red bull to show up on the side of their packs huh I guarantee you it's probably like Red Bull advertisements, isn't it? People love Red Bull. Damn, okay. Oh. Cresson's to Leeds deal was done. Agreement reached. Personal terms are okay. Player in Leeds to complete medicals. Goodbye. But as per, there's been serious problems between the two clubs about terms of payment. Also the buyback clause. Oh my god. Really? At that, it stalled all the way at that point? That's insane. That's crazy. He's even at Leeds finishing a medical. I wonder if it's Leeds at fault or Bayern are at fault. Pack dead and Hazard. Oh, wow. Lone pack. We ballin'. We ballin'. Uh, Ocampos. Sell. <laughs> yeah, Dan James-esque. Exactly. Concerning, man. I don't like that. I do not like that at all. Russia Dortmund crown chat could have a uh... wow, bro. I genuinely am wondering if this is like another s opportunity to make good amount of good amounts of coins. Gareth Southgate goat. Gareth Gareth South goat. Um, thank you for the uh, for the resub, bro. Timo, Doko, Jimmy, uh, the real Donald, Ryan, Flex, Walrus. I wasn't paying attention. I thought for some reason that was a walkout. Um, this guy seems like a good starting striker. Especially at that price. Uh, Piatti will be good to use. Time to center forward. That. Packed Fonzie. GG. Uh, GG. Lost Lakers! Welcome back, man. Good golf. Thank you, guys. Appreciate the resubs. Much love, much love. I really hope this Cuisson steal happens, man. He feels like a younger DePaul, which is exactly what we wanted. Not a walkout. Packed a walkout yet? Two. One inform walkout and one regular walkout. But that not it's not been great. Uh, I'll be the first to admit that it's not been great. But that's the casino, right? I'm not here to, 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 to try and pack an icon every four packs. We're just here chipping away, building up our club slowly, trying to have a good time. More importantly, I just want to be having a good time, man. I, six, seven years of running strict RTGs and uh, poor man RTGs and, and getting up in arms about the, uh, one pack not giving me something good and ear or frauds or uh, taking a loss and taking it way too much to heart because every win means something on a poor man road to glory. I just kind of want to chill, man. I, I'm still going to be competitive in weekend league and all that stuff, but I, I just I just don't want it to be that deep, if that makes sense. You know? I do not have the full game. I'm on the trial right now. I'm really hoping that there's a second trial. Was that a, was that a walkout? No. Nope. Hey, Batch. Nick, you may need to set some guidelines for these new channel points privileges. No one is going to want to chat when they see they got aided in the chat lull. Justice for Luke. I'm not going to be doing any of that. Thank you, Donald, for the 100. The chat can be carnage, dude. It's fine. Neymar is live. Thank you for letting me know on my own channel, dude. I appreciate that. Amazing. Ooh, Adidas UCL final. That's kind of a cool ball. Do you suggest I go turn my uh, my own stream off and go watch him? Give me a walkout, man. I just want oh, that was a board, though. We skipped the board. That was a board. Did you guys see the plinth at the bottom? Damn it. It's just Tadich? Serious? And I guarantee he's a discard, too. So we'll just keep him for now. Um, 
artists. Did they change anything in terms of the boost that artist gives? Um, glove is the OP chem style for keepers, so we'll keep that. Um, I don't know, man. I think I, I don't know if those actually have a value. Do 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 be, be, de, be, do be, do do. Uh, uh, walkout is based upon the three vertical lines besides the door, not on the floor. No, I I'm aware. I love that. I love that. Oh baby, you know we're going with that for the stadium uh seat setup. Heck yeah, dude. See, I wish you could just apply it from here. Why can't you? It seems silly. Like, I hate that I have to go into yet another um, section, if that makes sense. I find that so silly. It's such an, a weird added thing. Bro, my chat. Every time I look at the chat now, maybe I do have to get rid of that, man. I don't know. People just getting fisted left and right for timeouts. It kind of, like, defeats the whole purpose of someone getting timed out. Oh, uh, I don't know. Ooh, nice. Okay. He's not worth much, so I'm going to keep him. Uh, Diop will keep. Yeah, we'll keep. Oh, no. Buendia's pack pulled. Now we can let him go. Oh, he's used for the advanced SBC. Make it like 100k. 40k is a lot, man. Like, that's why I'm so surprised people are getting fisted. Like, 40k points. I thought it would happen, like, every once in a while. You know? I, I genuinely thought it'd be like a once in a while thing. Maybe because it's day one. It's the busiest day, uh, you know, uh, for the launch of FIFA. Like, we, we we're averaging like eight to 10,000 viewers. So, it's just a bit nuts. Maybe it'll calm down after. Oh, let's go, baby. Give me that shadow. Shadows I'm keeping because I'm going to apply it, apply them to players. Um, Cards. None of that means anything to me. Okay, we got nine more spots on the trade pile, boys, before we get into gameplay. I didn't. I honestly did not think it would take this long to fill up the trade pile. I'm actually <laughs> shocked that uh, it's taken this long. That's not a board or anything, so we'll just, uh, just move on. Man, it's kind of mad, the, the player values. Is he even worth anything, this Vicino dude? Really? Uh, how have the packs been? They've been okay. Not Nothing particularly great, but I, I'm pretty efficient with, the, with packs. Like, I'm selling everything. Discarding everything else. So, we're actually doing very well in terms of building up the club right now. Uh, Coin-wise. The casino itself hasn't been good to me, but it, I mean, the casino is never good to me. So. Um, I'm, uh, uh, oh, I wonder if I give this to Alfonso Day. I'm going to keep this too. I haven't decided whether I'm going to go Guardian or Sentinel for Fonzie. Just depends on his uh, interceptions and stuff, right? Luke's just getting annihilated. <laughs> Oh, it makes me so happy. You can't time me out. I'm the channel owner, Tice. I'm, so, I'm sorry, dude. Uh, as much as I know you guys want to time me out, it's not possible. This is a dictatorship, dude. Come on now. <laughs> oh my god. This is savage. <laughs> Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, sure, sure, sure. Yeah, I will. No, no, not, 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 not yet, not yet. Probably like in an hour. No, oh, thank you, Shane. Um, flying, thank you so much, man. Keegan, thank you so much as well. Hey, there's Big Dick Dyer. Let's go. Uh, does he, is he worth anything? Worth a bit more than discard, but do I even want to list that? I don't know. Uh, so I'm going to keep that. Maestros, we're holding. 
Seven more spots in the trade pod, boys, before we get gameplay. Do we want to do a rivals qualification game, though? Or squad? I think we'll do rivals qualification game uh, for, obviously, for the epi. Squad battle stuff we can do off of YouTube. Um, and then, so the plan is, uh, this should make YouTube here, maybe the tail end of the video here for you guys, but the plan is as well is because I'm going to continue grinding until the start of next episode tomorrow, we're going to start recordings at close to 6 p.m. UK. Any marquee moment that we get, our Malika is going to be doing, like creating a highlight for. So Twitch clips are turned off, but, um, any marquee moment that happens. So any player above like 20 K that I pack, our Malika will make like a numbered highlight for it. So let's say the second we end this episode, I hit a Lewandowski. He'll make a highlight like, uh, Lewandowski, number one, Lewandowski. And then 10 minutes later, you know, I, 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 I win another game of squad battles or, or we unlock something else or we open another pack highlight number two and then th and then at least that way at the start of this next episode hey, i'll have like a nice um so documented review of all the all the things that we've done five time marks um hey. since last epi hey batch hey habibi love the content i got sissoko boating brosovic military and a couple more what's the advice man greater than three uh if you're gonna use the coins sell them and use the coins if you're not going to use the coins just hold the players they're going to do nothing but go up in price anyways uh i thought 10 hours is gameplay only yeah sure how long does downloading ultimate team take i have no way of answering that my bro that depends oh, on you and your internet connection my nipple um these were good value right so we'll do that so is this. This is like 2k, isn't it? Yep. Hey, Batch. Uh, Best players I've gotten so far are Edison, Pjanic, Bongnucci, and Inform Caputo. Probably going to keep them loving the content. Much love, CKY. Kfer, thank you. Uh, w, thank you for the gifted sub as well, bro. Appreciate it, man. Much love, much love. Hey, Batch. Can we mod Luke for 100 bits? He's loyal. Uh, no. Cost you a hell of a lot more than that. Um, Simakas. That. Okay, so I think I think someone's getting getting bullied. Someone's getting bullied a, a, a bit heavily. Maybe more so to the point than I even like. <laughs> Um, hey, Batch. More 100? Um, nah, it's gonna cost you a fortune, my bro. Thank you, Olar, though. I appreciate it, man. Much love. Mo, thank you as well, dude. Appreciate ya. I mean, I thought I could go to maybe get one more walkout, but it's not happening, man. Ooh, straight up purple. Yo, I love it. It's amazing, I love it. <laughs> Does left wing back matter? No, not really. Okay, we got three more spots, dude. So I'm I'm assuming only like one or two more packs, really. Um is there anything we should put the 90k into, guys? Anybody specifically that you see is is cheap? Um What 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 are we thinking? I don't think anybody's cheap anymore. I think everybody's boosted up in price like crazy right now. Um, dude, Ramos was 70k. 70k last night. I don't even want to go look at what Ramos's price is now. It's gonna make me so sad. Uh, is he okay? He's in the Austrian league. Roger. That. Oh! Turkey, German, hold ah! him. Save Luke. Alan, thank you for the twenty. That's a twenty dollar donation to save Luke. So what I'm gonna say is that keeps Luke safe for the next hour mods. Okay. No matter how many people burn points to time him out, let's uh let's keep him safe. That twenty dollars I think has earned him a, an hour of safety. <laughs> yeah. Um, 
Okay, I think that's all good. That's all good, boys. Um, someone else I did want to test out as well is... I just feel like someone like this is really, really, really overpriced, man. I don't know. To me, that feels overpriced, doesn't it, to you guys? Put Luke back in the gulag. I feel like that's Boku monies, man. That's Boku monies. Um, anybody else with a decent? Uh, what about this dude? He was like twenty k mouth. His prices hurt my soul. I'm so sad. I wish I grinded harder trading yesterday, man. I really do. What are they, what? Dude, can can that, someone else explain to me what the hell is going on right now? Look at this. What is going on? Why are like why are like certain players just appearing but not showing up with other Look, what? Are you seeing that, guys? Why is that happening? That's a bit confusing to me. I wonder if they've done that on purpose. Super weird that players don't like aren't, aren't popping up. Um, what about attackers? I bet you this guy's awful. Um, I I guarantee Hold on, where is he? I guarantee you this guy's like 100k. Okay, 80 rated too, for God's sakes. I guarantee it. Bad. Now, St. Maxim's not a bad shout though. Here it is again. What is f***ing going on? I'm sorry. I don't mean to complain. I don't mean to complain. I think I, I, I'm trying. I, I'm not necessarily moaning. I'm more confused than anything. Bale is uber money. I'm assuming Net probably tripled his money last night because he was able to buy like 20 of him for 30k. I guarantee you Bale's probably like 80k now. I think you can complain about glitches. Yeah, I, I, I agree. Thirty seven K feels like an okay pickup, actually. All right. Got a got a little bit of the sniping going, boys. So what I'm trying to do here is not sit on coins, as you can tell. I'm trying to always make use of my coins. So I'm trying to clear out the garbage in the club. And then, um, so what I think we're going to do is we're going to use him as a super sub. Um, I'm going to need a Newcastle player here as well, though. How am I going to do that? Um, the Newcastle player. Central cam, striker. Let's get Richarla Goat in here too. Uh, some meadow in there. Get Allen in here. Um, is. So Richarlison's going to go in once a bot. We lose Obamiang's um, card. Right cam, striker, left cam. I was thinking Alan as the uh, left DM. And central cam. 
could sub on Ericsson as a central cam. What do you guys think? It's not a bad setup, actually. Okay. Uh, can I use four three? Th can I? Can I use? Can I just straight up use four three three for chem? Does four three three flat work for chem, guys? I think it does too, doesn't it? Yeah. There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bye. Brazil the donkey. Dawn. Oh. Um, so Sameto is going to get thrown in once this beast is gone. All right. Now I've got Ericsson for nine games, which is kind of spicy. Uh, apply consumable. I think I'm just going to throw a maestro on him. Why not? Uh, we're going to toss a shadow on Posh. And, uh, Calvin. I'm not going to do the CDM to center mid just yet either because I have no idea what the hell the, the, the setup's going to be, but there we go. Good. Oh, there we go. Okay. Um, so, oops, I did that wrong, didn't I? Yeah, 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 sorry. So for someone like St. Maxim, what are we looking at for chem style? Is Deadeye the play? You would think so, right? Kind of crazy how few finishers I've, I've packed. So St. Maximin with a Deadeye, uh, Obama Yang, we'll just give him a Marksman purely because I only have him for five games anyway, so whatevs, right? Um, Bernardo, though, I want to give an engine. I think that'll help him out a lot, make him feel pretty spicy on the ball. We're going to get to test him out. Um, Loftus Cheek's getting subbed. Uh, Calvin's got a shadow. Alan, uh, normally I think I'd give Alan an engine as well. Give Alan an engine. I want him to be a bit more box to box. Fonzie's going to get Guardian. Um, uh, Hernandez is going to get Anchor. Hunters and Shadows are like 2 or 3k a piece. So, not bad at all. Um... Sentinel, not eight games is still enough. Um, I don't have Neuer yet. Neuer will probably be someone I pick up pretty quickly. Give that to Ulrich. Okay. So I think that's decent. Custom tactics wise, I, I'm not going to do uh, anything too crazy. So I'm going to just stick to balance for the time being. Maybe even possession. Uh, I'm going to stick to my... Normal setup as well. In terms of that. Uh, formations. So as always, going to be no no real changes here. Um, what the hell is the 4-2-3? So it'll be 4-2-3-1... St. Maxim, wide left, Obamiang, striker, Calvin will be right DM, Allen left DM, um, Ruben Loftus-Cheek will be subbed out for Christian Eriksen, and then everybody else stays the same. Um, I think all of this is going to be pretty basic as well, actually. Uh, I think the only things I'm going to do are... What I used to have set up previously, which is exactly that. Um, 
Okay. Allen. Um, forward, cover center. Alvin, stick back, cover center. Yeah. For the time being, obviously, this is going to, uh, th this will adjust as time progresses, of course, right? I have no idea what the, what the meta is going to be. Zero clue. Um, but this is, this is just what we're going to roll with for the time being. Now, Fonzie, with the boosts. So his reactions still don't get a boost. Balance does get a boost with Guardian. That's kind of interesting. His interceptions are up to 80. Look at the boost for standing tackle. Dear God. Oh my God. What the hell is this? Guardian might not be the play for Alfonso Davies, really. His reactions and composure don't get increased anyways. So defensively, those are the two you'd want to get worked on. However, his standing tackle being 90 is crazy. His defensive awareness being 85 is fantastic. Interceptions of 80 is great. Um, how is his stamina only 79? That seems a bit idiotic. <clears throat> I uh, I do genuinely feel that's a bit dumb. Hey, but anyways, Batch. and then Calvin. In about 10k FIFA points, no walkouts, but have packed Dembele Valverde too close to Man and Regalan. What should I do with them all? Uh, for the three trillionth time, I, Duncan, thank you for the bits. I appreciate you. If you're going to use the coins, hey sell the batch. players and use the coins. If you're not going to use the coins, hold Pulled the players. Delict for my first pack of FIFA 21. This might be a half decent year in the packs for me, lol. <laughs> How Calvin doesn't have 95 stamina blows my mind. But anyways, there we go, boys. So we're going to run into a placement game right now. Uh, I think I got to go here. I go division rivals. Um, I gotta remember to switch to the gameplay screen when we get there too. Okay, don't have to worry about fitness. One of the small victories for all of us, I suppose. Probably play the game first to see what it's like. Thank you for that amazing suggestion. Eight ping. Why do I have a sneaking suspicion that that will not at all be 8 ping? Why do I have a, a sneaking suspicion? Damn, okay. So, first qualification game against the La Liga squad. Marcelo's in there. Rakitic at Sevilla's in there. Isco Disco's in there. Okay. Not bad. Again, don't forget, these will be sweaty games, boys. Very, very sweaty games, okay? So it's a, it's a home game for him, as far as I can tell. Yep. So none of that really, uh, really particularly matters. I need to make a pause. Let's switch to... Um, wait, if I'm on this menu, do you guys still see the scoreline? You kind of still do, but I'm going to try and have it on this one, okay, guys? This is the gameplay uh, screen. I just might not remember to do it every time. I do apologize if that is the case. Oh, okay. This looks promising. Disappointing pass. Okay. It's like this is very zoomed out. Okay, so he's doing the um, skill dribbling, Joao right? And returns to Joao Felix. Oh. Wow. Hey, back. Okay. I lost goal? my second rivals game 8-6. to six. I don't know if no one can defend or if it's the new player runs ETH away. It was a fun game, Bale and Um, Alright, let's test out Ericsson here. Alright, hey, no no hate from me, man. I'm, I'm, gonna, I, I, I'm in new beginnings, boys. Not going to be too concerned with it anyways. Uh, trying to figure things out anyhow. Um, yeah, annoying commentary, though, is going to get fisted, so... <clears throat> This guy's definitely had the game for a while. No, these are qualification games, so I don't even know if there's any way to know that or not. That's just what early access is, right? You gotta understand that it, this is the sweatiest community on Earth. Why? Because who's sitting there playing the first 10 hours of the game seven days before the game's released? Only the most hardcore players, right? So kind of just gonna be um, understandable. It's not, uh, it's not the end of the world. Well, the one thing I'm going to have to get used to is it does seem like um, 
defensively you got to be a bit smarter also i'd love i'd love to understand how he gets his players to move because it feels like my players are kind of just standing back um and watching him play calvin phillips concerning obama young hmm okay well, sloppy in Tackle. possession yeah, like I'm, I'm, I, it feels like he's able to pass through me, um, where all my players are standing around doing nothing. But when I get possession of the ball, he's like running through my back and getting the ball back pretty, uh, pretty effectively. Nice work, Calvin. Okay, so I thought maybe his right back would peel away from um, Saint Maxim. Not to be the case. The right back read it beautifully uh, without him controlling anything. So, duly noted. Can't select the player I want to select, for God's sakes. Welcome back to FIFA 21, Nick 28T, first post of thousands for the year, uh, surely. Lovely. 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 We'll skip it, boys. We'll skip it. But that is lovely. I'll take that. <laughs> One of, for sure, 100,000 posts and crossbars for the year. Most definitely. Beautiful tackle, my bro. Oh God, how do you? Uh, is it L is it L two R two for drag backs, guys? What the hell? How do you call for the ball? How do you get someone to sh uh, to show short? I clicked R one to get someone to come short for a pass, and I like did a super boost tackle or something weird. Okay. That's got to be a new mechanic or something. Calvin! That's see. The fact that that's still in the game is outrageous, dude. Beautiful tackle there, and it just triple deflects back to him. Oh, it did just triple deflect back to me, too. So, blocks seem to be very OP from the AI still. Hope I like that. I was dealing with Love that! St. Max! Lovely, baby! Good stuff. Um, it seems like the sticky foot and stuff like that is still very much a part of FIFA. Uh, I don't know if it's uh, just all in my head or what. Also, he scored from kickoff, didn't he? Love that. Oh, he's lost his head here. Okay. Maybe I need a bit more composure there, boys. I think I might need a bit more composure. Um, taking a shot there early is a bit silly. Let's go, Calvin. Okay. Bounces are crazy. Silva. <laughs> Bit of pressure there. We're definitely uh, employing the Bielsa high press very nicely. The AI uh, seems to be clamping me up very well. So I wonder, now even uh, this early in division rivals, if I should be sitting here preparing like a counterattacking setup once we take a lead, right? Because I, I don't know if I'm doing myself any favors here by uh, pushing up the field too much when I've got the lead. Chance to do damage. 
find a gap in the defense. Phillips. Half time, my bad. Didn't really uh didn't really realize it. Didn't really realize it. My fault. I mean that is a dominant first half, I'll say. Very proud of the boys so far. Feels good. I think Richarlo Goat's gonna come on for uh St. Maxim, maybe. Tail end of the game. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. So not a uh not a bad start. Based on myself. Alan. Christian Eriksen now. I don't, I don't, I gotta figure, I gotta figure out how to play. I, I don't mean that in a bad way either. What the hell? Okay. So it's not R1 for, to get someone to show for a pass. I don't know what it is, but it's, uh, it's not that. Offside. Great play though. Really, really nice play. Um, this guy isn't really controlling his defenders, which I feel like the through ball should be pretty powerful in this situation. Come on, Robin. No pens. No pens. No pens. No pens. Showing patience. Looking for the equalizer. Passing through me like my players don't exist. I don't like that. Nice old read. Good outlet. When the chances are few and far between, it's very important the forwards stay focused. Not many chances wow, that, that is such a heavy pass. In the game. Okay. And Two bars of power there. Hey, Amen. Love that. Love it. How do you get someone to show for a pass, man? That was like what a, such an, a crucial part of my... Uh... So, I mean, you can definitely see that AI blocking is very strong still. He didn't do anything to touch his center back, and his center back just dove into that block. Unfortunate. But ironically, I feel like I conceded because I didn't control my center back quick enough. So I do find that odd how um, he's pulling his DMs out of position big time. Oh, that's beautiful. AIOP man, AIOP. AIOP. Not for me though. You guys feel like fucking morons. Look at this. Love that. Out of position. Love that. Come on, baby. A chance maybe from the wide position. Sam Axima. <sighs> what do you guys think? That, did I have time to take another touch there? Maybe. Ooh! Get there! Oh my lord, man! The risky play that this guy's doing. He's just getting rewarded. Well, rewarded by not conceding, at least. Come on. There it is, Allen. Is he worth 37,000 coins? Absolutely not. I mean, I don't think any player is worth their price right now, but... Um, Alan. Sam has it. He's got the right idea with that pass. What the f... Okay. Sam Aximan. That's dirty. That's two posts. Come on, man. We're not doing this for another year, are we? You're not making me solve world hunger by trying to create a goal-scoring chance and then have me hit the post. Like, come on now. That's two, man. That's two. I'm not saying I should be 4-1 up, but 3-1, I think, would be a fair scoreline. Ridiculous. Alan. And the ball with Alfonso Davies. Promising-looking ball. Someone show. Love it. Okay. I want to throw up. What? Why was that so clunky, man? That's it. That's it. He's moving his keeper, man. Wow. I didn't realize this was the level of sweat in freaking division rivals placement. Oh, my God. 
He moved his keeper near post to make that save. Expect, I guess. I didn't, I didn't know I was playing uh, my final game for top 100 in foot champs. <clears throat> Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Uh, five and zero placement, I think, is D two or D one. Get like hundred and twenty k. So this is also probably why it's so sweaty in placement games. People now know. I'm struggling, boys. I am. I am. I am struggling. Um, someone that just runs around with one player covering passing lanes is uh doing me a lot. That's a foul, no? Okay. Well, there's a saying in football no. that you always get one more chance. They need that chance. What? I thought I was in possession here. He's going to score. Good defensive play. No worries, though. Right back to him. Come on, boys. Love that. Marcelito overcommitted. Apologize for being too cute. Oh, wait, where's the Leeds badge? Hey, EA, what's the deal here, man? What's the, where's the badge? Why is that a, is that a glitch? Is that a known issue? Did they lose rights to in-game badges? Without even telling anybody? Let's go, boys. Good stuff. Allen with the thunder batch into the, oh, that's a bit of a bad pass. St. Maxim's a bit of a donkey. Sorry to say. And taken away. The referee has decided that there will be just one minute of added time. GG, boys. Okay. Me running it out of bounds there? Um, I, I, It's because I'm clicking R1 to have a teammate show for a pass, and they're, like, super boosting the ball. Good defending. I'm not going to say anything. I was about to say something about manual defending feeling like it's semi-decent. Um, it's early days. I, I do feel like I'm rewarded to, to, to winning the ball back with manual defending, but I, I don't know if that's just because nobody knows how to play the damn game. And also, um, I think I think it's pretty pretty easy to, to argue that uh, it's early days, right? So does it really mean... Oh, great. Terrible music is back in the freaking menus again. Amazing. Um, but there it is. Dominant game. Nice little 3-1 win. Um, had some difficulties there. So, hopefully we can do a little bit better as, uh, as time progresses. Am I pressure on heavy touch? No, I'm on balanced right now. Balanced. Um, so there it is. 1-0-0 right now. <laughs> I mean, 2,800 wins so far, boys. Um, not bad. Not bad. So, if we go to... The transfers, we do have um, 58 items sold. So I'm going to get back into the grind uh, of packs. I don't think uh, we're going to do any more packs, at least for the end of the epi. I think I'm going to call it there. But just so you know, this is what we'll be doing on stream. Uh, we'll be back again tomorrow for 6 p.m. content, as mentioned to you guys. Um, and anything that happens, our Malika will be posting... Uh, can't make a clip, but we'll be making a highlight every time something happens. A 10k plus value player we pack. Or if I buy a player off the market, Armalika will be making a highlight and we'll be numbering them. So I'll know from like 1 to 10 uh, what highlights to look at. So right at the start of next episode, we'll do our intro and then we'll go through all the, the different things that happened from now till then. There might be one thing that happened. There might be 20 things that happened. I'm not entirely sure it'll be different every single day. But as always, thank you guys so much for the support. It's going to be a little bit um clunky f until we get full access to the game uh on the 6th of october is when things will really start kicking into gear we'll start organizing past and present squad builders uh player reviews if there's anything that you want to see uh me do by the way please let me know in the comments or jump on uh on the twitch channel and 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 let me know i, I was thinking of going through the leagues and starting to test out um quote unquote starter squads so why is it not letting me uh there we so random 
Anyways, um, like league by league and starting like maybe like a 100k Premier League team. Uh, you know, my, my thoughts initially game one is St. Maxim. I think he hit the post twice. So a bit clunky, especially considering the Deadeye. I mean, Deadeye is not a bad uh, chem style for him. I, I know his finishing isn't great, but still 75 finishing isn't terrible. So St. Maxim felt clunky. Aubameyang felt pretty damn good. Not going to lie. Um, pretty amazing when you look at uh, Marksman and what it gives you. Wow. No balance and agility, or no agility boost anymore on Marksman. But the finishing boost is pretty great, and the shot power boost is pretty good. Um, Bernardo Silva felt kind of terrible. I'm not going to lie. Uh, he might have 90 acceleration. It didn't feel like he had 90 acceleration. But dribbling and passing-wise, he was pretty good. Um, Erickson didn't feel that great. Calvin didn't feel as bad as I thought he would. It's only one game, but he didn't feel as bad as I thought he would. I, I will say, though, you know once we got to the tail end of the game you can kind of see how good Allen is Allen was very good engine chem style makes him pretty nuts as a box to box mid uh I'll, I'll happily admit that medium high work rates too he might end up being like as we start competing in weekend league this Allen might end up actually being my dm calvin might move on to the bench until he gets uh, an inform or an upgrade down the road but this Allen was uh was a pleasure fonzie was great hernandez was great robin kosh was pretty awful uh i'll be the first to admit that I think any of the opportunities that came through the team were coming through Kosh's side. Trent felt okay. It didn't feel as slow as I thought. But then again, I don't know if my opponent had that pacey of players anyways. And then Ulrich with the glove chem style. You can see why the glove chem style is, is so good. Ulrich's reflexes are good already. Then the glove chem style gives him 89 diving. Uh, what is that? 86 handling. And then uh, 84 positioning. Like it's a That's a pretty decent starting keeper. Do I want Neuer in the team? Definitely. Absolutely. But for the time being, it's not bad. Anyways, I love you guys. As always, we'll catch you on the flip side. Peace.